In this iPad Basics Quick Click, I'm going to show you how to record a voice memo. So we're going to pop over into the app Voice Memos and you'll see it's a nice simple screen. To record, I just tap on the red record button and it's going to launch the recording immediately. So you either need to be ready to say what you want to say or at the end we can trim and delete. When you're finished your recording, you can click Done and it places it in this new screen. So from here I can listen back by pressing the play, launch the recording immediately. I can also edit. So I'm going to tap on that editing button now. And when I tap on the blue editing uh, button at the top, this pulls up my trim bars. So using my finger I can slide it across to perhaps uh, here, this is the part I want to trim, maybe it was something I wasn't supposed to say and I'm going to tap on the word trim down the bottom. Now if I'm happy with my recording I'm going to say save and I'm going to say done. Again I could listen back to make sure it was exactly how I wanted it to sound. So I'm going to tap on the words at the top new recording to give it a name. I'm just going to call it test. And you can see immediately it's in my left sidebar there. From this screen I can delete my memo by pressing the rubbish bin or I can also bring up some sharing options. So I can airdrop, send in a message, I can um, duplicate it, save it to files, do all kinds of things from there. Once I delete a, a voice memo, you'll notice it gets popped straight into the recently deleted file folder. And that will stay active for 30 days, so if I've made a mistake by deleting, I can actually go back and retrieve a voice memo.